Namaste and welcome to this exciting episode of Sartology, Debunking Mythology. अभी मैंने अमेरिकन साइंटिफिक का एक रिपोर्ट देखा अमेरिकन साइंटिफिक एक ट्विटर चैनल है और एक ऑर्गेनाइजेशन है दे आर ट्राइंग टू एक्वायर प्राणायाम थ्रू डिफरेंट ब्रीदिंग एक्सरसाइजेस फर्स्ट थिंग आई वॉज टेल यू कि ये जो अमेरिकन साइंटिफिक ऑर्गेनाइजेशन है ये क्रिश्चियन अप्रोप्रिएशन कभी सबको पता लग रहा है योग इज द मोस्ट पावरफुल एक्टिविटी टू कनेक्ट विथ परमात्मा भगवान से कनेक्ट करने के लिए योग है American scientific group doesn't know what is योग so they are just using the breathing exercises. So they want to keep the योग out and accept breathing asana, and which is uh, they are going to connect to give some American names to that, you know, which will be used by the American Medical Association. They say नाम किया के cardiac coherence breathing, और नाम क्या है box breathing, military method. So and Wim Hof method. Wim Hof method are the yogic traditions are called Wim Hof method. Mindfulness, complete debauchery, plagiarism by the American scientific community. Ye, these are nonsense which is going on. जैसे I will advise all the yoga practitioners. Don't call it dog pose, cat pose, mountain pose, camel pose. These are all. Stupid terms. You are minimizing the importance of yoga. आप सब लोग योग की इंपॉर्टेंस को मिनिमाइज कर रहे हैं भारत में तो बिल्कुल यूज मत करिए भारतीय गवर्नमेंट शुड सैंक्शन दीज ऑर्गेनाइजेशन इंडियन गवर्नमेंट शुड सैंक्शन अमेरिकन साइंटिफिक फॉर प्लेजराइजिंग योग दिस इज गोइंग ऑन एंड विम हॉफ मेथड दिस इज टोटली नॉन सेंस सो वाई दे डूंग इट बिकॉज दे अंडरस्टूड इट इज इंपॉर्टेंट एंड नाउ द क्रिश्चन वॉज एक्वायर इट because uh, there is nothing original in christianism nothing catholicism all fake ideologies no original light no originality okay they steal and they call it their own well who is them half some phd guy what is the importance of phd guy taking something free and calling it phd and publishing a paper getting rewarded by american university normal people can't get into american universities because it's too expensive and they put scholarly consensus there and just to plagiarize what is the ancient free methods yoga is free for everybody you pay for the teachers so that they can maintain their livelihood and they can continue teaching but then the moment west takes it up everything becomes a business i have seen with every single thing i'll tell you therapies cow therapy everybody knows everybody knows cows are the most sensible sensuous and emotionally connected animal so no therapy in the world with animal is as effective as cow therapy no other therapy because cow therapy is mentally invigorating ab usko bhi le lenge so ye chori chalti reh rahi hai chori chal chori pe chori chal rahi hai chori pe chori chal rahi hai weird psychology completely opposite this is my book transcending the mind what does patanjali say asana sthira sukham asana asana means posture so there is no yoga studio in america it's called asana posture okay i'm only talking about people who are making money out of yoga poses asana is the right word don't misuse don't appropriate wrong terminologies foolishness of european scholars has been exposed the lies of european academics has been exposed everything has been exposed now throughout the world in the small 500 million people out of which only 10 people or 20 people understand yoga why because they want to make money out of it everything is money 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 So I'll request American scientific to withdraw these stupid things what they're doing. Second thing, I'll say, Pratyana Shethindyan Ananta Samapatti Bhyam. English is a very shallow language. I'm communicating to you in English so that you can understand it. Hindi is complete, or any other Bharatiya Bhasha based on Sanskrit is complete. English is not complete. English language itself doesn't connect with yoga. English language doesn't connect with yoga. No Latin language connects with yoga. 
only Sanskrit can exit the yoga. So why not remove, if American scientific wants to use it, why not use the original names? Why to create new terms? Why to confuse Americans? Why cheat Americans? Why cheat American taxpayer money? Okay, so asana becomes perfect when it is done either with easy endeavor, prayatana chathilya, or complete consciousness of ananta. Ananta means Brahman. So this is how the asana becomes perfect. So according to this, in Patanjali, there is no. This is the book transcending the mind. It's my book. I translated Yoga Sutra. So therefore, I have an authority on these topics, at least theoretically, because yoga is, in, is infinite and I am just a student, I am just a practitioner. So he says, Prayatna Shaitilya, relaxed Ananta, or you connected with the Ananta, Brahman, that is Asana. So that means even Asana is not being taught properly. Dog pose, camel pose, what is this? What is this going on? At least understand what you are talking, what you are teaching. Don't cheat Americans, don't cheat Europeans, don't cheat South Americans. Learn Sanskrit. I can teach you if you come to me. My programs on Yoga Sutra are there designed to bring authenticity in yoga in North America. Yoga is everything. Yoga is spiritual. Yoga can be used for material benefits. Yoga can be used for humanity development. And yoga is the only thing which is required by humans to do. If every karma, it is said, yoga karma su kaushalam, yoga karma su kaushalam, yoga su guru karmani, samam takta You know, yoga is the art of doing work. Yoga is the art of doing work. The book which mentions yoga the maximum is Bhagavad Gita. And these pranayam steps, which they are calling such stupid names, uh, Wim Hof method, military method, box breathing, cardiac coherence breathing, all garbage, garbage. Use actual words, Anurom Vinom. Actual words, you use actual words. What is the problem in using actual words? Because you are scared. Oh, Hindus are going to come here. Hindus are already here. Many people, many Americans, they love Hindu culture and they practice yoga as it is. That's why my book is called Yoga Sutra as it is. Okay? So, at least bring honesty here. What does the uh, Patanjali say? Tasmin Santati Shwasa Prashwasa Yoga Gati Vicheda Pranayama. Pranayama is defined as once properly situated in asana. What is the benefit of asana? Tato dandva nabigat. Then the yogi is not attacked by dandva or dualities. Okay, that is asana. And then once properly situated, regulating the inhalation and exhalation of breath is called pranayam. I mean, this is pranayam. So stealing information from Patanjali and giving it new names and then teaching others new names, what does it mean? It's called cultural appropriation. It's called plagiarism. It's called theft. It's called stealing. Do you think this is required? Or should it be required? So where is the American original research on mindset? That is only in one book, Yoga Sutra. There is no other book talks about mind so openly. Bhagavad Gita. Most of the European scholars sell one thing today, after five years, they sell something else and they neglect, neglect the fast one, they call it evolution. No, it's called stealing at every step. Stage one you are stealing, stage two you are stealing and then telling, pe telling people, yes, you are evolving. You are not evolving. The, the average the average, uh, you know, now I am a student of history, I have written most of these books, many of these books I have written, some of these I mean, books I have written here. This is such an utter stupidity that nobody in India renamed these original principles. But the Western academics have the gall, balls to rename it just because India is silent. But we Americans are opposing it. We are opposing it. 
This is academic plagiarism and liable for lawsuit, anyone who has money. As an author, I'll support anybody who has money to sue all these organizations for stealing the names, changing the names, and keeping the practices the same. The same thing is being done by Mantram Project in Europe. Who gave you the authority? Who gave you the authority? Now I'll tell you one more thing. Baidem tra sambhavritti desha kaala sambhavangi paridrashto dirga sukshma pranayam bejam baya vritti abhyantara vritti and stambha vritti become sustained with dirga deep and subtle sukshma when it is performed as per desh, kaal and sankhya. Sankhya means counting, regulated feature. This is written over here. You are doing exactly the same. Copy paste, copy paste, change the name. Box breathing. Box breathing is rechak. Box breathing. So, why this charade? Why this charade? Why this nonsense? Why you want to steal? Ask. Learn. Become a yoga practitioner. If the government of the United States makes yoga compulsory for every American, there will be no violence in this society. No violence. If the society becomes karma conscious, not God fearing, karma conscious, we don't have to be God fearing, we have to love God. Karma conscious, if everyone is aware of their karma, actions, karma doesn't mean results, karma means actions, then everybody will be, society will be peaceful, society will be happy. There will be no more cow killing. You drink the milk of cow. You take butter from cow, you make cakes from cow, and then you eat the blood of the cow. Which God will tell you, ungrateful? Anyone who is eating cow, after drinking milk, is an ungrateful person. Yoga forbids that. You cannot do pranayam by eating cows or eating meat. Yoga forbids that. Yoga encourages vegetarian diet. If you eat steak, stop going to yoga studio. Don't learn yoga. Not possible. You never learn it. Don't make money off of yoga. It's very pure, very simple. It's for all humanity. Everyone has a right on yoga. Do not misuse it. Don't appropriate it. Catholicism is failing because of appropriation. Because there was nothing original over there. It's a fact. Christianism is failing because there was nothing original over there. But now we're bringing the original culture of yoga in America. So many practitioners, almost 75 million practitioners. If yoga was a yogi was a political party, then win hands down. Everybody goes to yogi studio. They trust yoga teacher more than a regular teacher. But if you are killing cows, you are appropriating people's names, calling America yoga is Christian. The moment you add Christian word to yoga, Christianism is over. Yoga remains. You are so intellectually dumb. I am talking about academics. They don't understand the languages. Yoga word itself means connecting with God, connecting with Paramatma. That means yoga. So why so much plagiarism? Why you want to steal everything and ban everything? Banning yoga and stealing the yoga principles. Is this humanity or this is the old British culture? Anglo-Saxon British culture where steal everything from India, Africa, South America, North America. What? For what? Still, even today, UK is a poor country, third world country. And we will become more because of the karma. Stealing all the wealth, bringing it over there. It's stupidity. Why engage in such illegal theft stealing activities when some you can get it for free keep the original names anyone who is watching this video go to American scientific put a lawsuit on them because those guys are, are culturally appropriating somebody else's legacy it's called classical demagoguery so I am very upset with those people who are doing this I will tell you more. Baya Bantara Vishaya Chhebi Chaturtha the Sanskrit. Okay? The fourth type of pranayam extends the Baya and Abhyantara Vishaya. Tata Shiyate Prakasha Varanam. 
So why I don't want to, so you have to be qualified to get that. Join our courses on Yoga Sutra as it is. Join us and get the purity of yoga principles in. No more stealing. And I'm, I'm just wondering, where is this Yoga Alliance? So we are starting a new certification in psychology, certifying people on Yoga Sutra as it is, and we vehemently oppose, and anyone who is watching this video must oppose American Scientific, and anyone connected with them. Thank you. Do like, share, and subscribe our channel. Tell us your feedback and let us see how we can move forward together in this new yoga world and make America the home for yoga for Americans. So if you are in any part of the America can benefit a lot from yoga and we all have to do that. So let's do that, bring peace, happiness, tranquility, which nobody wants nowadays, it seems like. Let's do that. If you really want to help Americans, teach yoga in an original way. Don't do half days like oh, stealing these words, what is it called, box meditation and cardiac coherence, all this nonsense is not needed, not needed. Okay, thank you. Do like our channel, subscribe to our channel, let us know your feedback. Namaste. Om Shanti. Jai Jagannath, Jai Jagannath.